This guy's company was nearly destroyed by Apple. Now he's making billions by beating them. Minnie Cao excelled as an engineering student in Taiwan after graduating from the University of Tennessee. His work on cutting edge tech for both NASA and the US Army gave him his billion dollar idea to make GPS technology available to everyday consumers. He then teamed up with Gary Barrel in 1989 and launched a company they called it Garmin, since it used both their names after building their first GPS unit. It looked like the company was doomed, since each unit cost $2,500 to make. But the US Army was happy to be a customer. By 2000, the company had $220 million in sales. Paper maps had become a thing of the past, and millions of people around the world were using Garmin's devices to get around. But then Steve Jobs stepped on a stage and changed the world. When the iPhone was announced, it became clear people wouldn't need to buy a Garmin GPS GPS anymore. A group of runners in the company suggested Garmin pivot into fitness trackers. The company touted its sophisticated technology to appeal to hardcore running enthusiasts. Garmin is the market leader today in smartwatches that cost over $500.